Today in Algebra 1, we learned how to use the vertical line test. The definition of the vertical line test is a test to see if a graph is a function. We're just kind of developing this topic of functions, and this is one of the tools that we will use to tell whether or not one is a function. Yesterday we talked about what a relation was and what a function was. Today we want to look at their graphs in particular. To use the vertical line test, you're going to draw a vertical line. And if it crosses more than once, it is not a function. If it only crosses one time, then of course it is a function. Let's look at some examples. If I look at this line right here, and I draw some vertical lines on it straight down, I will see that none of them repeat. They only cross once in each place. So this one is, yes, a function. Let's look at another one. If I look at my x and y axis, and I look at one that looks like this. If I draw a vertical line, notice it crosses one, two times, and so this one is no, not a function. Look at two more just to make sure we've got a good idea. If I talk about this one right here, if I cross right here, it only crosses once. But if I do a vertical line here, it crosses one, two, three times. If it crosses anywhere more than once, the answer is no. So that one is not a function. What if I look at this one? Once, 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 once. So this one is yes, a function. Finally, I want to review a few quick things from yesterday. For example, let's talk about a chart. I have a chart or a table, and my x's are 2, 3, 2, and 4, and my y's are 0, 1, 3, and 4. And I ask, is this a function or not? The answer would be no, because there are two that have the same x value. Remember, a function has no x values that repeat. Let's try another one. What if I have this? 2, 4, 6, and 8, and it's a map. 2 goes to 8, 4 goes to 8, 6 goes to 8. Notice I did not repeat any x values, so yes, this one is a function. Let's try one more. If I have BHS, WIN, and B goes to W, and B goes to N, and H goes to I, and S goes to N. B went to W and N. So the answer is no, this one is not a function. The homework that goes with this is A3, and it's a worksheet, and I'll be happy to give that to you when you get back to class.